In this lesson I will teach you how to apply networking in Ubuntu. So let's start with an overview. Previously, that is up to Ubuntu 17.10, network configuration was in ETC network interfaces. And a configuration file looked like this. So auto ETH0 ETH would enable the ETH0 network card. Then we have the iFace settings, uh, which you can do for iNet, which is IPv4, as well as iNet6, which is IPv6. So in this example you see how to set a static IP address on v4 as well as v6, including an IPv6 gateway as well. And in order to activate you would use IF down followed by IF up. But that has all changed. Since Ubuntu 17.10 we have NetPlan. NetPlan is a new way of dealing with network. Uh, the configuration file is in a YAML file, in etc NetPlan and the default YAML file is 50cloudinit.yaml. Uh, you can edit this file to set a static IP or keep the default which will uh, request a DHCP address. After applying your configuration you can use sudo netplan apply. Uh, that's all you need to do to read the new uh, YAML file and apply it to your networking. On Ubuntu server you can manage configuration using the netplan CLI. And on Workstation, you can include a renderer network manager to manage with the network manager GUI utility. And that's the same network manager as we have seen in the previous lesson about networking on CentOS. If you want to see some examples, uh, some nice examples are on the NetPlan website. NetPlan.io slash examples contains a couple of configuration files. Before I will demonstrate NetPlan, let's have a look at a sample configuration file. So here we have a network uh, configuration file. Notice that the configuration is written in YAML. And it doesn't show very well on this slide, but in YAML uh, the indentation is very important. You know what? Let me just show this on my computer. Okay, here we are on the Ubuntu machine. And I'm going to etc netplan uh, and I'm opening the 50 cloud in it .yaml. The reason I wanted to show this file on my computer is that uh, here we see in a much better way uh, the layout of YAML. In YAML indentation is very important. And indentation in YAML typically happens by using spaces. So we see the network definition. And in the network definition we have the configuration for the ethernets. And indented one level deeper we have the definition of ENS33, which is my uh, default network card. Then we have the addresses. You don't have to specify what type of address it is. You can just add a list uh, of IPv4 addresses and IPv6 addresses as well. Uh, notice that the IPv6 address needs to be between single quotes. Next there is the gateway uh, for IPv4 as well as the gateway for IPv6. And finally there is the name server addresses telling which DNS you should be using. Uh, so netplan apply is what you need to apply the configuration and IPA will show you uh, whether or not the configuration was applied successfully. Here we can see uh, the current IP configuration has successfully been applied. As you might notice it doesn't show the word dynamic anymore. And also we can see the IPv6 IP address. We haven't really talked about IPv6 as that's not an LFCS requirement but I wanted to show you anyway. Uh, let's type IP route show. IP route show is uh, showing the routing table. Uh, if you also want to see the IPv6 routing table, then you can see right here that the default is set uh, via FD00 colon colon 1. And that's all we need.